Photoshop has a really useful option for resizing images in a batch process. So you could do this with hundreds of images all at the same time. But watch this video all the way through because there is one problem here. And if you save incorrectly in this process, it overrides your original images and it resizes those. We don't want to do that. We want to keep our original the same size and then create a new folder for all the resized images. So I'll show you the process step by step. It's pretty simple, but you just have to make sure you don't write over your original images. Let's jump in. The very first thing I want you to do before you even do anything in Photoshop is I want you to make two folders just on your computer here. So I have one called original images. And then the second folder is called resize images. Resize is empty right now. But the next step is bring all your original images that you want to resize and put them in one folder called original images. So everything that I'm going to use here is in this folder. Now what I need to do is I just need to open one of these in Photoshop. So I usually like to right click open with Photoshop or you could open it any which way you like in Photoshop. Now on here, we're going to create an action and we could replicate this action hundreds of times. So we need to come up to window and open up the actions panel here first. And with the actions panel, it doesn't matter if you have actions in here already. I just deleted all mine, but press the folder icon here. And then we're going to name this one resizing. And then under resizing, we're going to add an action, press the plus sign here, and I'm going to resize everything to 1000 pixels. So that's what I'm going to name it. And then I'm going to make sure the set is the folder I just created and then press record. Now it's recording. So everything you do now can be replicated automatically. Very simple three step process. First image, image size, and then type in whatever size you want. So 1000 pixel is what I want. You could change any settings here and it's going to remember it though. Press OK on this page. Now resizing is done. Next, you go to file and go to save as. Do not do save because it will write over your original. Do a save as here. And instead of my original image folder, I'm going to choose the other folder called resize images. So the first one is going to be resized this way. I'm going to press save, then change the quality here. If you need to lower it, I always leave it on maximum 12 here. So I'm going to press OK on that. And then the last and the third one is go to file and close. Now go back here to Photoshop, click the logo if it took you out and we need to stop this action. Press stop here. So very simple three step image size change, save as and then close. Now we need to replicate this over and over again, right? The batch processing. So go to file, come down to automate and choose batch. Now here is pretty simple. Choose the set. That's the folder. Choose the action resizing to 1000 pixel and then choose a folder here. And then we're going to choose our source. So that's the original images folder here. Choose that. And then we need to decide our destination where the save images are going to go. So I'm going to choose folder again and choose this time our resized images folder. And there's already one in here, right? The one I just resized to make the action. That's okay. Go ahead and choose that. And now if you press okay, it's going to take place in the background. Now it may take a while if you have hundreds of images, for example, and your computer is not very fast, but let me go to the finder here. Look at this. These are my original images. And these are my resized images. I'll go ahead and show you one of the settings on one of them here. This one started with 3,500 or so pixels and my resized, if I go ahead and press command I here is exactly 1000. And all these are exactly 1000 here. And you compare file sizes here to see that all the reduction took place in this batch processing. And it's that simple to batch resize any number of images in Photoshop. I hope you found this useful. Please give it a thumbs up and I will see you next time.